Hello YouTube, so this is my second episode of the Destiny 6 gameplay. So to be honest, I don't really know what the hell is going on in this game because it's relatively new and there are not much guides on it on, on the internet. So here I'm showing you the Tower of Promise gameplay for today, which is one of the features in this game yeah so basically I, I don't really know what the heck is going on I just auto play everything for the past one day and this is how far I have come anyway I'm on the Asia server so if anyone wants to add me, feel free and uh, join my guild team SG. So basically, I don't manual play. I just auto play everything because I'm lazy. I'm not sure if there's any healer in this game cause I've been looking for one as to, uh, at my adventure stage I came to a point where I can't progress anymore because I don't have any heals but I haven't come across any hero that can heal there's only a damage reduction okay so we'll proceed to the next floor we'll just clear all our TOP keys for today we have 10 keys as you can see here Alright, so if anyone got any idea what the, this game is all about or any guides, please uh, feel free to share them in the comment section and I'll take a look at them and maybe make a beginner's guide video so that uh, people can play the game so that they won't get lost in the game like me as of now. Basically, I just clear adventures, clear my Tower of Promise, clear daily dungeons and yeah, everything on auto mode. And swap the heroes around just so that I can see what each individual hero does. These are the very low level so it's relatively easy. Yeah, so we clear it again. Oh my account level up, so I'm gonna show you guys about this airship generator which can generate some rubies, which is good in the game. So here's the airship. Yeah, so you see there's a gold generator, there's key generator, and there's a ruby generator to collect gems to summon heroes or buy some costume. Okay, you see I can enhance this now. Yeah, we call it 18, 16. Okay, so I'm gonna do one more last run of Tower of Promise here and I'll stop the Let's Play episode for now and I will come back in a day or two when I have a better idea of what the hell is going on 
and a better understanding of the game. Oh yeah, I got this guy, this Adonis guy, which is good. He has an invincibility buff on his active skill and also on his strike skill, which is very good for PvP because you can literally get zero damage and yeah so you can't be damaged by your opponent and for this Sierra it can you see it can uh, damage absorb from me from uh, for your teammates so I put them together so that we have a higher chance to survive dungeons. So this is my dungeon lineup by the way. Which is not really good because all of them are paper elements. So sometimes you need a elemental advantage leader depending on which adventure stage you are attempting. Alright, so I guess that's it for today's Let's Play episode and uh, hope to see you guys in my next video. Thank you and goodbye.